Hi YouTube friends, well, welcome back to my channel. For those that are new here, welcome. My name is Elise and I am a Timu addict. For those that have returned, thank you for uh, coming back to my channel. I really do appreciate you coming and taking the time to watch my videos. So, I received a parcel today from Timu and as I said, I am a Timu addict. So I thought we would go ahead and open it up and see what we have got. So, hold please, I will open it and then we can have a look inside. Alrighty guys, so I am back and as you can see we have had a change of venue. Um, as I was doing it, my husband decided to walk in and decided he wanted to watch TV. So I thought I'd come down to my she shed and do it. So let's unwrap it and we'll go from there. I actually can't recall what I got, which is strange. Usually I'm pretty good at remembering and I'll go and have a look and see what I ordered to remember. So let's go ahead and open up this packet. Can't believe how much they pack into these packages. And I think I say it every time and every video that they stick so much in. So let's have a look here. I started off, I started off, I got this and I can't remember what it is. So let's open it. A little bit damaged on the top. And we'll open this up and see how it goes. So how's everybody's day been? I hope everybody is doing well and um, has had a really good day. It is my day off from work today, so yay. I got to do my Timu order straight away. So while I am sitting here and opening up this package, I was wondering with you guys, is there anything you would like for me to show you or see? Being new to this, I don't know if you just wanna see hauls or um, travel videos or anything like that. So uh, let me know. Um, down in the comments box if you just want to see hauls or travel videos or a day in my life um, Just let me know as I said, I'm all new to this. Oh So this is I do have a Cricut machine and um, I am making some tote bags for my sister and I have got some iron-on vinyl so this is um, just a black iron on vinyl to put it on shirts or tote bags or material um, and it's a lot cheaper than buying it at Spotlight and even off some of the vinyl websites that I normally get it from. So I got this one and I'm not quite sure how much is in there. I will put it down in the description box or the price and all that one. So heat transfer vinyl. So for anybody that doesn't know what Timu is, or where have you been, if you've been hiding under a rock or something, because it has gone crazy. Timu is an online marketplace that sells everything. Everything, everything. Um, it's women's clothing, men's clothing, pets clothing, pet supplies. I think it sells anything bar food. I don't think it does any food that I know of anyway, but it is awesome and I love it and I'm addicted like I mentioned before. And um, they have a 90 day return, which is really good and free shipping at the moment. So, and that could change now that they are getting busier. But let's keep on going on with the order. I ordered 12 pack of wash, washing up sponges um, that should last me a while. I think a four pack at Woolworths or our local grocery store is twice the price of a 12 pack in um, Timu. So we have got that. What is in here? I didn't bring I did not bring a, ah, that's right, it's easy to open. I think.
think it's easy to open as I say that now. Oh, oh I know what this are. Comes with screws. So I have done a makeover on our bedside tables and our dressing tables where we put our clothes. And I've done a um, chalk paint grey. And I wanted to use little crystal um, handles or knobs. Now, I looked at Bunnings and I've looked um, at, say, Kmart. And they were quite expensive and I've got here so I've got two boxes of 12 so I've got 24 and um, I'll put the prices so you will have a go just be mindful that the prices I put up may be different when you go in and look for them so they may be um, a different price but I'll put the price I paid for them and I will show you when I just finally get them up on my bedside table. Alrighty. So I've got a bit of everything this time. A bit of clothing, a bit of home homeware, craft. And even got stuff for my husband. So I bought a 50 pack. I think it's a 50 pack of sandpaper to put on your well like obviously sandpaper to put on your little sandpaper machine whatever it's called the sandpaper machine now this was quite I think this was about $16 for a pack of 50 Again, we went into our local hardware store to um, see if we could get some. And I think for five, it was about $16 for just five of these. And I got a pack of 50 for that price. Um, and these are all different size grits that I got. So, um, and when we went into the hardware store, the hardware store said they were having trouble um, purchasing these so Timu for the win here and I did get on again it isn't a very big haul so I did get onto the bandwagon of those little I don't know what you call them perfume bottles where you stick it on your perfume so you're not having to take the whole I don't know why I'm spraying don't know why I'm smelling it. There's nothing there. Hello. Um, where you stick it on the bottom of your perfume bottle so you can fill up a little one. So you're only taking a small amount away. And next week we are going away. We're actually going on another cruise. So it's only a four day cruise. So I thought I would fill up my two favorite perfumes because I got a black one. And I got a red one to see how they go because normally I take both the bottles and they're rather large so they take quite a lot of room in the suitcase or in my in my toiletry bag so I then got a red one and as you can see you've got that little hole where you just put it on and fill it up so I'll let you know how they go I also got I can't put that in there don't worry about it I also got a little not a pen at least that looks like a pen but it's not a pen so I got one of these and this is again for crafting with my Cricut machine you have to for those who don't know you have to weed out the areas you don't you want on your on the cutouts and this one here is just like a little pen weeder so you can just weed it so it's just got a i don't know if you can see that guys a small pointy end where you can do that so and then it's just like a little pen because my weeder that i have got with my cricket machine i actually dropped on the floor and it bent crazy 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 so let's see what else did i get here some clothes i still haven't got the little timu bags I don't know why I want one. 
But I want one that says Timu on it. It's crazy. Crazy me. All right. Okay. This is a little maxi dress. Let me just get up on my knees here and show you that. So just a little spotted maxi dress. Um, I got it in the in a size large and I'll tell you what the material is I'm pretty sure it's a polyester and yeah it's a hundred percent polyester but it's I just thought I'd get this it's a little um just a little maxi dress just to wear it around casually I'll put an insert so you can see what they look like so I did get that. As I said, not a big haul this time. And then I got, as we are going on a cruise, even though it is winter, we are going up north where it is going to be a lot warmer. Sorry, I'm just going to get myself comfortable again. And so I bought this little shorts and top set. So these are the shorts. And they are elastic. I did buy those, this in a size. Mm, hasn't got the size on. Does it say it on the top? I think it could be. No, no size. <laughs> no, might be in here. I bought it in a size large as well. And this material is made out of 100% polyester. So it's just a little off the shoulder top there with a little pair of matching matching shorts as I said even though it is winter here we don't have a cold winter here where we are and the further north we go the warmer it gets so I thought that would be still good to um, wear on the cruise and lucky last as I said not a big haul I did get a pair of shoes and I did get on the bandwagon for the little clear shoes. Now I don't know but these remind me of Cinderella shoes and they are cute but I, I like the clear because I think you can just then put them on with any, anything. Now it's from the, it's got a little saying on the little saying on the bottom and what it says is from the moment you own a pair of fashion shoes oh, it's not a saying it's a story telling you about buying these shoes fashion shoes you will be truly favored as it is an honor for us and his skilled hand made crew to present you this experience okay let's have a look at the let's have a look at the other one from the moment you own a pair of fashion shoes, you will be truly favoured as it is an honour for us to, and his skilled handmade. Okay. And I got them in a size 38. Clear heels. They seem pretty sturdy, which is good. And they're not too high. Getting old these days to wear high heels. And they have, I don't know if you can see, little air vents. So... Let's see. I will do a better view of these, but I'm going to try them on here and see if they they fit. Or, oh, golly gosh. Oh, yeah, they do. <laughs> I, I will show you a proper way. But look at these. Little, little clear ones. Not working at all. So let me show you in a better clip when I put it on on the side. But um, that is all I do have for you today for my Timu haul. Uh, it wasn't very big. It had a bit of everything. Um, so guys, again, thank you so much for taking the time to watch my videos out of your busy day. Um, it really does mean the world to me. I have been looking at my little um, pop-ups and getting new subscribers i really do appreciate it i love doing these videos um like i've always said they aren't professional this is me this is what you get 
um, I just love showing you guys and sharing what I got. It is, it, it's fun and what I do. Um, it's funny, somebody said to me the other day, so what are your hobbies? And I'm like, I don't, oh, excuse me, that was my stomach, it must be hungry. Um, I don't really sort of like have hobbies. I do craft and I do stuff like that, but I don't really have any hobbies as such. But now doing YouTube, I really do enjoy doing it. Um, and I love interacting with everybody that makes a comment and, and um, thanking me for doing the videos and, and I really do appreciate it. It really makes my day. So as long as you guys are happy for me to do it and not get all the professional stuff that you get, as I said, you got a different view because I started in the kitchen and then my husband wanted to come in and watch something on TV. So I've ended up down in the she shed and you see me sitting on the floor. This is how I get it. But guys, have a wonderful day. Have a wonderful week. Um, again, means the world to me that you are watching it. So take care and I'll talk to you soon. Bye for now. Alrighty, so here is the little maxi dress and here is Rocket running to and from. It's a bit breezy out here. So uh, if you can see, the maxi dress reaches the ground on me. So if you had a pair of wedges or anything, that should be perfectly fine. It feels really nice on. It feels nice and comfortable. I think I probably could have gone a, a smaller size, but this is perfectly, perfectly fine. Um, the material is pretty good as in for see-through wise, and you can't see through it here. So again, a nice, I'll walk this way so you can have a look. It's a nice little casual maxi dress. I would probably actually a pair of wedges or a pair of um, platform runners would look good. So this one is the maxi dress. Okay, so the next one is the little short outfit. It is quite cute. No pockets, unfortunately. Um, a bit cold to be wearing it today because it is quite breezy out here. And sorry, I've just taken it out of the bag and tried it on. So it is, is creased. So it is off the shoulder. You can put it on the shoulder if you want or one way. I think it just looks cute off the shoulder. Nice little summery outfit. The short, look, truthfully, I don't know if you can see them, but the pants are quite see-through. So you would have to wear nude colored pants, but they would be rather be all right if you had swimmers um they're all right i don't they're not too short where it's showing your uh, your cheeks and it's all like elastic here so if we take this out this is the top so you could wear that and what you could do is obviously the top you could wear with a different with a different um, bottom and the bottoms you could wear with different pants so there could be quite a few um, different options just an elastic top again pretty sheer i have just got a a little strapless white bra on and i actually quite like these and you could probably wear them with those white shoe uh the, the clear shoes hold please and i'll go get them so you could even wear this little outfit. Oh, I've got Missy and Rocket here with these shoes. Sorry, I have to step back. So with these shoes and um, to make it dressy. Again, dress it up, dress it down as much as you like with these shoes. And here's Missy. When? what's your opinion, Missy? Guys, right, so this is the shoes. They look really cute. They actually even look really cute with this little outfit. So you can make dress this little outfit up. Um, they feel very sturdy. They don't feel flimsy or anything like that. Um, I was a little bit worried that the 
plastic um, may not fit me, but being um, plas like plastic with the with your body heat, it sort of like warms to it. Now these are a 38. These are a perfect fit, and I'm pretty stoked with them. I'm very impressed actually, and I think these were only 19.98. And I did get on a, on a on another website and they were like nearly $25. So I'll put the prices there for you, but I'm really, really impressed.